Something out there just changed direction. A fragment of rock and ice traveling through the infinite dark has now turned toward us. This is not fiction. This is 3i Atlas. And what scientists just witnessed could rewrite everything we thought we knew about interstellar visitors. For days, astronomers across NASA, the ESA, and private observatories remained silent. But now, leaked trajectory data from deep space monitors show something terrifying. 3i Atlas, an object that came from another star system, has just altered its path directly toward Earth's orbital zone. It began as just another night of observation at Mauna Kea Observatory, Hawaii. A group of graduate students noticed a faint blue object slightly shifting its light signature, something no comet should do that far from the sun. Within minutes, the object's trajectory software began blinking red. It wasn't slowing down, it wasn't deflected. It was changing direction intelligently, purposefully, as if it were reacting to something. At first, everyone thought it was a data glitch. But when NASA's Near-Earth Object Program verified the same anomaly, panic spread through the control rooms. An anonymous engineer from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory posted encrypted files on an internal forum. 3i Atlas has adjusted its trajectory by 0.4 degrees in deep space. No known gravitational source nearby. This is not natural motion. Within hours, those files were deleted, but not before independent astronomers confirmed. 3i Atlas had changed course toward the inner solar system. 3i Atlas wasn't the first interstellar object to visit. Before it came Oumuamua, the cigar-shaped mystery that baffled scientists in 2017. Then Borisov, a more comet-like visitor. But Atlas? Atlas was different. It behaved like neither. It spun irregularly. Its brightness pulsed in perfect time intervals every 11 minutes and 12 seconds. Almost like a signal. When scientists beamed radar toward it, the echoes came back distorted, as if something metallic was buried beneath the surface. On October 17th, deep space telescopes registered an unexpected burst, a shortwave radio pulse coming from the exact coordinates of 3i Atlas. It wasn't cosmic noise. It had structure. Three repeating tones, then silence, then three more, almost like Morse code. Governments classified the event within hours. NASA's public feed for Atlas tracking went offline. The European Space Agency issued a temporary calibration blackout. But amateur astronomers using amateur equipment caught the trail and posted the raw data online. The pattern was real. And it was coming closer. Astronomers calculated a subtle but undeniable course correction. Instead of continuing out of the solar system, 3i Atlas curved just slightly, toward the plane of Earth's orbit. At its current velocity, it would pass within 0.04 astronomical units, dangerously close, about 6 million kilometers. But the new data shows that gap shrinking. What could make an interstellar object change its trajectory mid-flight without any known gravitational or thermal influence? Some said it was solar outgassing, jets of vapor that can push comets off course. But at that distance, the sun's heat couldn't cause such precision. Others whispered, maybe it's not a comet at all. Behind closed doors, the U.S. Space Force reportedly elevated its deep space alert to code AMBER. Radar arrays in Greenland and Guam were repurposed to monitor 3i Atlas's incoming vector. And then came the strangest part. The Pentagon refused to deny it. When questioned, NASA's spokesperson simply said, We are observing an unusual behavior in the object known as 3i Atlas. Further analysis is ongoing. But for those who understand orbital mechanics, unusual behavior means one thing. Propulsion. Infrared satellites detected faint emissions, rhythmic bursts of heat from one side of the object. The bursts were synchronized, three pulses every 12 seconds. That pattern matched the earlier radio code. The implication was chilling. This wasn't random. It was communication.
Was someone or something trying to announce their presence? Or was it an automated signal, an ancient probe finally awakening after eons in the void? A small team of physicists from MIT released an anonymous paper online. They titled it Non-Gravitational Acceleration of 3I Atlas, Evidence for Controlled Maneuvering. The document described how its spin axis aligned perfectly with its direction of travel, impossible for a random rock. Their conclusion, 3I Atlas may not be a comet. It may be a derelict craft, a relic of another civilization, drifting across the stars, now inexplicably reactivated. But who built it? And why now? Why turn toward Earth? Media blackout followed within 24 hours. Most mainstream outlets labeled it as a harmless comet. Yet astronomers' private communications tell a different story. Encrypted messages leaking through dark web channels. One reads, If it maintains current velocity, intercept window begins mid-December. We are not ready for this. Meanwhile, telescopes in Chile and South Africa observed something extraordinary. The object flashing in sequences, almost like binary code. When decoded, one astrophysicist claimed it repeated a simple mathematical truth. One, zero, one, zero. On, off, on, off. As if demonstrating awareness. By early November, the comet's tail changed color. From icy white to a strange ultraviolet hue unseen in natural bodies. It reflected light more efficiently, almost like a metallic surface unfolding. And for the first time, the James Webb Space Telescope locked onto it. The infrared imagery revealed structures, ridges, and something that looked alarmingly geometrical. Not random. Engineered. NASA's public data stream from Webb cut out seconds later. When it came back online, the 3 I Atlas entry had been erased. Scientists who spoke out were silenced or reassigned. One radio astronomer from Prague posted a cryptic message on X before deleting his account. It's not coming for us. It's calling something already here. What did he mean by that? Could 3i Atlas be activating something dormant, an old beacon buried on Earth long ago? As 3i Atlas draws nearer, an unexplained increase in atmospheric ionization has been recorded, faint magnetic ripples spreading across the upper layers of Earth's magnetosphere. Some say it's a coincidence. Others aren't so sure. At the same time, strange auroras have been seen near the equator, glowing blue like the comet itself. People report hearing low-frequency hums at night, vibrations that make windows tremble. Is it atmospheric interference or something else communicating with what's coming? Now, observatories worldwide prepare to beam one final message to 3i Atlas, asking a single question. Who are you? No one knows if the object can respond. No one knows if it's even listening. But the timing couldn't be worse. Its path now intersects directly with Earth's orbit within months. NASA predicts a near miss. Independent analysis say otherwise. And in the silence of space, the blue light grows brighter. The last update from NASA's Deep Space Network came just before dawn. 3i Atlas has accelerated. That shouldn't be possible. Comets don't accelerate in open space. Unless something powers them. It's now officially moving faster, and the new vector confirms it. It's not passing by. It's coming. The question is no longer, what is it? The question is, why did it turn toward us? This is not the end. It's the beginning of contact.